The key to a successful delivery of any presentation is practice. Practice, practice, practice. You can't really expect the live delivery to go well if it's the first time you have delivered it. Does your rehearsal process involve just running through the slides while reading the words in your head? Rehearsal, now, a practice or trial performance of a play or other work for later public performance. It's not a proper rehearsal until you say the words out loud. After all, you're not going to be thinking the words when you deliver the presentation to a live audience, are you? Well, not unless you're delivering a session on telepathy. You really need to rehearse as if it was live. The clue's in the word rehearsal. It needs ears. Someone needs to hear. Rehearsing in front of colleagues is always a good idea. This will give you the chance to practice it out loud and it will give them the opportunity to provide you with valuable feedback. However, your colleagues may be busy and although they might have the willingness and desire to help, they might not have the time. Working remotely can make this option even less viable. Trust me, I have three cats and not one of them has had anything constructive to say when I've rehearsed presentations at home. So, PowerPoint to the rescue. Let the software do the hard work. PowerPoint Online now has a built-in feature called Presenter Coach. This feature does exactly as it says. It coaches you while you present. Surely not. Surely yes. Simply open your presentation and go to Slideshow Rehearse with Coach. You do your thing and let the coach do their thing. The coach will give you instant feedback if you talk too fast or too slow. If you're simply just reading the text from the slide If you use filler words such as M, um, so, you will be prompted about your pitch and tone if you are speaking like a robot. It's not all bad, you will also be told when you're awesome. The coach will even let you know if you are using words that could be deemed offensive or non-inclusive. But wait, there's more. Once you have finished rehearsing, you get a detailed report of your performance. And believe me, you will want to keep doing this again to try and beat your high score. And of course, you will nail that presentation when you are going live. This is so useful and I have used it many times over the past year. So now, there really is no excuse for under-rehearsing and under-performing. <laughs>